Hi Facebook, this is a non planned out video, but I wanted to get on here really quick and tell you something that just happened to me that really struck me. So I'm getting on here to share it with you. So um, I use my phone to count my steps that I do every day. You know, I try to get like 13,000 steps in every day and I use my phone to count it. Uh, I use an Android, so if you're a, you know, uh, Apple user it's nothing personal I just use an Android so and I don't I don't have a watch because I don't like jewelry so I just use my phone I just keep my phone around and it counts my steps today I was walking and um, I looked at my phone to see how many steps I did and it did not it wasn't registering what I was doing and so I'm shaking it to you know make it think I'm jumping so that it starts counting how much activity I'm doing and I'm telling my phone, hey, start counting my steps, you know, register my activity, register what I'm doing, keep count of, of my output, you know, essentially. And I just heard God speak so clearly to me. He said, your, what you're doing isn't having an impact and that's why it's not registering. I wonder how many of us, it, it mean, I, I stopped straight in my steps when, when I heard this. And I just wonder how many of us are doing activity day after day after day after day but we find ourselves in the same place what we're doing isn't registering what we're doing isn't having any type of impact in the natural or in the spirit and we find ourselves getting frustrated and we're yelling at whatever thing that we think should be helping us like hey keep track of what I'm doing and why isn't this working and yeah and um, so anyway I asked I said to God okay what what will help this situation? You know, what can fix this thing? And God said, it's the position. It's the position of the phone. That's why it's not registering your steps. But I felt so strongly that this also, you know, had to do with our heart posture, with our willingness to learn, with our willingness to adapt and to uh, respond to instruction when we're giving it, when we're given it, that shows we're off track in some way. And so, you know, what's actually a funny story too is that this has happened to me before. A few months ago I was traveling and I was staying with a bunch of friends in the same house and I was going running in the morning. I went running in the morning and I came back after like, I don't know, 45 minutes and they were like, well, I run for distance. So how far did you run and what route did you take? So I'm telling them the route that I took, but it was wrong <laughs> because my phone didn't keep track of the steps correctly. And so I told them how I ran and I was like, it was only like three miles. Well, they went on that same exact route and it was like twice that. So my point here is that you can be operating in the best way that you know how, right? You think that you have all of the instruments that are gonna help you and you go and start implementing that stuff and you come back and you tell other people like, oh yeah, this is, this is how I got there or whatever. And the whole time you were doing it wrong. You know, when those people, my friends came back, they said, yeah, that was six miles. That wasn't three miles. <laughs> that was six miles. You know, because when I got done, I was like, wow, I feel tired. You know, I wonder why I only went three miles and I feel so tired. It was because I had the wrong information that was given to me. So, uh, so you can also be leading others down the wrong path if you don't fix what you have, you know, your own self. So I get back from my walk and I'm, setting up stuff for tomorrow. Tomorrow, I, I film my YouTube videos, I have a YouTube channel and I film my videos weeks in advance. Uh, this gives my editor enough time to fix it and to upload it and all that kind of stuff and so that I'm never stressed out about if my video for this week is gonna be done. And tomorrow's video is called Fix Yourself and it's all about using what you have in your hands in the appropriate way. It's all about making sure that you've actually done the correct analysis on where you are, on who's in your life, on how you're receiving their words, their advice to you, and all of that kind of stuff. And so um, at that moment, I realized like, okay, I filmed these weeks in advance. This has been on the schedule, you know, for at least a month to be released uh, today uh, or tomorrow morning. And, um, or actually, I think it's tonight. Sorry. <laughs> it's coming out sometime today or tomorrow. And uh, so I sat down and I was just really... Uh, I just really felt like there was more to be be had here, you know, in this in this kind of conversation that I was having with God this morning on my walk, and um, 
and how it coincides with the fact that this video is coming out that I filmed weeks ago that I've quite honestly forgotten about and this thing that happened to me this morning. So what you're doing isn't having an impact and so it's not registering. When you find yourself in that place, no matter how many times what you have been doing has worked, sometimes that grace is gonna run out and you need to find another way to make an impact. There's a different thing that's required. There's something else that you need to do. And I just pray over all of you who are uh, watching this video, if you watch on the replay, that you just have ears to see and uh, eyes to see and ears to hear your next steps, your direction, that your, your steps would truly be ordered of the Lord, that what you would do would have an impact, that you would not just be doing through the motions, going through this stuff, but not seeing the, the harvest, not seeing the fruit of, of the effort that you're putting forth. You know, and if it requires you to change direction, to change position, to do something different, I pray that you would have the humility, the uh, knowledge and the wisdom to do that, the insight on how to change position, on how to shift so that these things aren't just, you're not just expending all of your effort and seeing nothing in return. So I hope that this speaks to somebody out there today because I really uh, felt like I needed to just take time out of my day and do this video. So I hope that this ministers to someone that it blesses you, it speaks to you, and I will see you on Saturday.